Hey guys, All In Crypto here and welcome back ladies and gentlemen for another YouTube video. Today we're going to be covering a project called Liquid. Uh, we have previously mentioned it on our Cardano videos where we said we are going to start reviewing and covering some of the projects that are going to be built on top of the blockchain when smart contracts have arrived. Smart contracts are set to be rolled out towards the end of the month early September. This is a project that is going to be built on top of Cardano. You can see Liquid right here next to Meld. Meld is another token that we covered and they both have similar functions. So in this video, we're going to be covering what Liquid is, we're going to be covering um, some of the tokenomics and we're going to be looking at things like what is the potential value proposition. Getting involved with an early token like Liquid could potentially present. Um, how we're going to do that is we're going to look at two examples, Compound and Aave, which are very, very similar to what Liquid is trying to be just on the Cardano blockchain. We know Compound and Aave are on Ethereum. Um, the uh, kind of head honcho of Liquid, I think Dwayne uh, Cameron, he essentially said he wants the user experience to be like interacting with Compound and Aave, uh, more so Compound. So we're going to talk about it all. Now, where I want to start, ladies and gentlemen, is by sort of addressing what Liquid is. So the best way for me to do this is go to the white paper. You can find the white paper. Um, if you go on liquid.finance, uh, you go over to the white paper and you've got the option between English and Japanese. I'm, of course, going to be using the English version as my Japanese isn't very fluent. Um, and we're going to essentially read the opening statement, which is the introduction. Liquid automated liquidity protocol for interest rate curves are agents that pull liquidity and make it available for earning interest on deposits and borrowing assets. The pull strategy removes the need for suppliers and borrowers to be independently paired based on borrow amounts, loan maturity, uh, dates and collateral types. This enables continuous liquid liquidity uh, provisions with no reliance on a centralized gatekeeper of fixed income products in traditional finance. This is the whole concept of DeFi. In layman's terms, what it is, it is exactly like a compound uh, where essentially you go over to um, the app, you connect your MetaWask, uh, MetaWask, MetaMask, um, but you'll obviously connect your Cardano wallet and you'll be able to interact with Liquid. So essentially how, how Compound works, and it's the same way that I believe Liquid is going to work, is you come over, connect your wallet, you'll essentially deposit your assets. Um, and we're going to talk about why I like Liquid, because Aave and Compound are very stable coin focused. They like to deal with tokens that are stable, whereas Liquid is going to go for volatile assets. Um, this is, of course down to how they're kind of going to kind of um, pull their liquidity and their liquidation process. Um, it's very, very interesting. So you come over, you deposit your assets and you can borrow against them. On, on Compound and Aave, you can borrow, I think, 90%. Um, I'm not sure exactly how much you'll be able to borrow against your underlying capital on Liquid, but the concept is the same. And, and this is coming soon. We are going to get into when is this going to be launched because it is still in the testnet phase. They're yet to be security audited. So they are in a uh, more early stage than perhaps Meld is. I listened to Hash, 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 Toshi and Kazen uh, Crypto. They did some brilliant interviews with Dwayne Cameron. Um, very revealing. Uh, that's where I've, I've got a lot of this data from, uh, listening to interviews and of course reading the white paper. So the one, th 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 there are multiple things that I'm excited for for DeFi coming to Cardano, and that is the fees. Now I use, and you guys will know on the channel that I use both Aave and Compound. Um, and to be quite honest with you, the fees suck. I mean, Aave is a little bit better um, because you can actually do it on Polygon. So the fees are literally fractional. Um, however, Compound doesn't have that option and, and, and the fees are still quite high. And if you're looking to play around on these protocols with a small amount of money, forget it. Anything less than $100, in fact, I'd say anything less than $500 to make it worth your while, just forget it because you're gonna pay 10% plus of that in fees perhaps. Um, and Cardano, of course, when we have these protocols, these versions of Aave and Compound built on top of Cardano, and Liquid is one of them along with Meld. Meld is more interesting in how they will allow you to borrow against your crypto and actually get a fiat um, deposit in your bank account. Liquid isn't doing that. They're just very much like a compound where you borrow crypto, essentially, whether that's a stable coin or whatever it is. Um, so I'm, I'm extremely excited for 
these DeFi projects, these versions of Compound and Aave to come over to Cardano because it's going to make the whole user experience, the fees, the, 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 the transactional time very, very efficient and appealing. Whereas on uh, on, on the two Ethereum-based products, then it, it, it's quite cumbersome. So um, what is the value proposition of perhaps investing in this? Well, and this is not financial advice, just like if you were an early investor in uh, something like Aave. Uh, this is Aave against BTC. I'm not sure why we've got that up. Um, Aave uh, against, you know, you can see Aave here and we've got Compound here. If you were an early investor and got on in the release of these projects, you would have done exceptionally uh, well as a result of it. You can see Aave there uh, at, its, at its top um, nearly a month and a bit ago, or nearly two months ago now. Uh, we'll move that because that's not very really clear. You can see, you know, 97,000% is essentially what they're giving you there. So if you, I'm not saying you're going to get that with Liquid at all. Um, Compound performed uh, a little bit less. Um, I think Compound was only about 1,000%. It's done. If you get in early on these projects, guys, and the personal, the reason I'm personally getting in on both Meld and this project, I'm already in on Meld in the staking pool. This hasn't been released yet. We're going to cover that in a second. Um, I believe you're going to do quite well as a, as a result of being an early adopter. You know, your money is going to do rather well in these protocols because I think the whole world is moving towards DeFi. DeFi really onboards that sector of the world that cannot get any access to the traditional financial system. It's a fairer system. You know, I love DeFi um, and I'm stoked for it coming to, to a blockchain that's going to provide us really low transaction transactional fees and, and we, it's not going to cost us a lot to interact with the smart contract um, and like I say it really is an issue for small time users because you have to there's, you have to execute a few smart contracts on campaign you have to deposit you have to borrow um, you know you have to pay back you have to claim it's all all of these have gas fees associated with and it can be really really expensive so so having these uh, protocols or a version of them on uh, Cardano is going to be fantastic and, and in hash hash Toshi's uh, video, Dwayne spoke about that and he said the reason we're building on Cardano is because of these reasons exactly. Now, in regards to the total supply, I can find 21 million tokens. So if we look at something like um, Aave, uh, which has 12 million, but it has a price of $350. So could you see $150 um, liquid? I think it's absolutely possible. I think DeFi as a space has a, has, has a, a long way to go. Um, and you know we're, we're we're super stoked for what's coming for the space and, and these protocols um, being extremely efficient due to them being built on Cardano, I believe are going to do very well. So come over to the white paper. The white paper is only twelve pages long. Before you get into this project, read it for yourselves. Only tw me as a dyslexic, um, it's this quite an easy read to be honest with you, um, and very very informative. Here they're breaking down the distribution. Uh, the user distribution will have 60%, the yield farm 10%, the DAO 5%, and the actual core team will take 25%. Always the core team get rewarded for creating something. This is how it works. People see a little bit of an issue with that sometimes, that the core team gets to take 25%. Um, they say things like, oh, well, what happens if they dump that 25%? They're not going to jeopardize their own protocol, guys. Uh, think about it like that. And I would rather they had that uh, allocation there as a kind of safe haven than... Um, than somebody else and we've seen that backfire you know we know with Jeb McCaleb and the whole XRP and Ripple story how he just dumps on the market and continues to do so um, as an opposition blockchain uh, so so really that is the bulk of what I got for, uh, what, I, what I have for you here so in, in regards to liquid being rolled out they're still having security audits they're still a test net um, they're still working on protocols uh, and you know, kind of ironing everything out. So we're not really sure, or I'm certainly, I don't think there's been a definitive date for when this thing may go public or there may be a pre-scale or whether they choose to IS uh, initial stake pool offering it. Um, but we'll keep you up to date on this channel. Go and give them a follow on Twitter. Um, always some interesting stuff coming out here. You know, they're, they're planning on partnering with Sunday Swap. So next, what we may get into, I'm not overly stoked. Uh, I like a Mergo, um, and I do. I will be getting into some Dexes, um, but which ones I choose, we, we're yet to see. But I'm really focused on the kind of uh, lending and borrowing platforms, um, some of the yield ag aggregators, um, and maybe one or two of the oracles um, and the payments. Some of the payments we like Coty. 
Um, but these are the ones that I'm focused on because they've been tried and tested. You know, they've worked on the Ethereum blockchain and, and that DeFi space and sector has, has been popular. So that's why we're going for them on the, on the Cardano sector. So I'm going to definitely keep you up to date with Liquid. Super interesting project. Dwayne uh, seems like he knows what he's on about. Uh, I think he's a Plutus pioneer as well. This is the rest of the team here. I've not done, admittedly, too much diving into to, to these individuals. Uh, I've just really focused on Dwayne and what the protocol uh, kind of seeks to achieve. And the reason being, um, he spoke about a tile prism as well. We'll, we'll save that for another um, video. This is, Cardano is underpriced for a number of reasons and a tile prism is one of them. That's all I'm gonna say on this video. Um, so about as a decentralized marketplace for lenders and borrowers, Liquid is an interest rate and it just essentially says the same thing. The white paper, go give the white paper a read. We're stoked about this project and we think for early investors, much the same as if you'd been an early investor in something like Compound and Aave, um, you know, you are going to reap the rewards um, as a result, I believe. And, and really we've used Compound and Aave because if you go and watch his Satoshi interview, he says, look, we want the interaction to be very much like how you interact with Compound. So it's the best way to kind of use an analysis. And for those of you who use Compound, you should be very friendly with the Liquid uh, protocol. And in fact, over the moon with just how cheap uh, and easy this is going to be to kind of interact with. So we're going to keep you up to date, guys. Super, super excited about this token. Um, I, my one critique, and I always like to give critiques, is the website. I've seen a lot nicer websites than this. Um, it's not. It's not a bad website. It's just quite uh, bland, I would say. Um, I, you know, for what that's worth, that is really my only critique. I can't really critique any of the uh, how it runs or anything like that yet because we're we're not there, and I've not really jumped jumped into any of the code. Um, because I'm not, that's not my area of expertise. But the, the, the website could do with a little bit of a sprucing up. But other than that, what they're trying to achieve, uh, the fact that they are going after more volatile assets, whereas Aave and Compound really focus on quite stable assets, is, is brilliant and game changing, much the same that Meld is game changing in the fact that they are going to allow you to take a loan out that's going to get deposited in your bank account against your underlying cryptos, which I think is fantastic and I will definitely be utilizing that tool. That is all I have for you in this video, guys. I'm going to love and leave you on that note. Hopefully you found this useful and it's giving you a kind of overview of what Liquid is going to be. If you've enjoyed the content, a like is always appreciated. So is a comment. And hopefully I will see you all in the next YouTube video. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Have a fantastic day.